All right, this is a quick walk around of our new Trail Series TRX 24 with the awnings and the porch and everything dropped out. Uh, today is a Monday. We picked this up on a Saturday. This is our, this will be our third night in here. Um, so far, so good. We're, we're learning the little kinks of what you can do and where to place things and um, how the solar works. So it's 30 feet from ball to the rear of the trailer with the gate up. I have the gate out on a patio at the moment. Uh, so LED lights under both awnings, which makes this one in the on the side here, the main uh, awning, puts out a ton of light. The back one is more subdued. Uh, it's a small strip, but it is controllable. You have multiple uh, intensity, so you're not blinded out there while you're trying to enjoy the nice weather. Uh, got the toy lock in the front here. We did get two batteries on this model from the dealer. They are lead acid. We'll see how long they last before we upgrade to something bigger and better. Twin 10 gallon propane bottles um, we have not loaded it with gas yet for the generator uh, they gave us some weird story about uh, it'll only suck down to about seven gallons the generator has a dip tube that doesn't go down to the very bottom I'm guessing maybe that seven gallons has something to do with the nozzle it's a Cummins gasoline generator and on the back side near the porch on the other side from here is the toy pump fuel pump um, got solar three max air fans we have not got on the roof yet but it looks pretty solid from what I've seen uh, overall length is about 38 feet from tip to tail with the gate down we uh, they have a little issue with our sliding doors. One sticks a little bit, but we're going to work on that and contact the manufacturer. We're actually on a slight rise, the axles, so we're a little higher off the ground in the front and the back. But the porch is fully extended, and that porch is probably three and a half feet off the ground at the moment, maybe a little more. But that's it. We'll get around to having some pictures on the inside uh, it's a nice camper the inside seems to be very customizable when it comes to the cargo area we have two swivel chairs one sofa that we've raised out of the way it comes with the two tables plus a little I don't know end table bar table I mean it's like a 12 inch square single pedestal table that you can put between the two swivel chairs um, TV comes rigged for pretty much anything a stereo system has speakers outside and in you've got uh, DVD player built in it comes with an antenna up top it's rigged for cable or satellite uh, so we can plug our Roku into it it's HDMI compatible and so we'd, we've heard problems of some of the TVs weren't all that great or they only did what they came with so we we're expecting to have to upgrade the TV, but that's not the case. Paint job's pretty nice. We're buying it in Texas, we're in Louisiana, and it was a 500, 550 mile drive. Uh, we got sidetracked and had to detour due to a slight problem we have with one of our pets that was traveling with us. And we got to go down some one-lane gravel roads through the middle of nowhere country, 30 or 50 miles southeast of, where was that town? Southeast of College Station. Um, trailer pulled well, tracked very well. Pulling with a Ram 2500. I uh, do say I love the way safe hitch. It's a beast but uh, it really did the trick pulling this guy. For you, those of you who have not driven in Louisiana, the roads over here are crap. The interstate over here is crap. People drive like nuts 
So if you've ever had to drive from Houston to Baton Rouge, Louisiana, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, this trailer bounced and banged around and we hit some bumps and we were on one section where I, I felt like we were almost on a seesaw. It was kind of a bounce, bump, 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 bump. It, yeah, I was starting to get a backache after 10 or so minutes, but thank you Highway 10, sorry, Interstate 10. Uh, yeah, we'll get a video and post the inside later. I know there's lots of them out there. I, I don't recall if there's a lot of new features or add-ons that they've done for this one. Uh, there is a pull-out tray in the very front there, which is really nice. And there's my Sheltie who has decided he wants to go for a walk. So I will end the video with that. And Trail Series TRX 24.